I just wish it would come out already. I've already had to wait a whole week for Ruby and Sapphire ahead of the rest of the world, and I've just been avoiding Twitter like the plague, and I can't watch YouTube properly, I can't go down my front page, because I'll hit spoilers. Spoilers are spoilers are spoilers. Why the hell have I had to wait an extra week for this? Oh, there's no reason, no, no reason. But either way, today is the day, today is the midnight launch of Ruby and Sapphire remakes, obviously. Uh, we're not going back in time somehow, but today is finally here, and I, it can't come any sooner. At the same time, I'm really sad to leave behind X and Y. I wasn't completely finished with it, to be honest. There's still loads of Pokemon that I haven't really touched. But anyway, in the last weeks coming up to it, I knew that I had to do something special. So, this is what I got. Baby Pokemon. Firstly, I really like the baby Pokemon. Secondly, you know I freaking love my underdogs. And thirdly, thirdly it just looks cool. And I also would like to see the reactions of people getting beaten up by these Pokemon. I mean, whenever you go on, like, on Team Batch and then you're like, what the hell is that when you're about to fight them? But them actually winning, that's got to sting. I mean, I'm not in a kind of nasty way, but hopefully they see the lighter side of it as well. But also, I hope that they, you know, bow down and see me as the gangster I am. <gasps> oh, okay, no, we'll stop that. I'm not, I'm totally too white and not qualified for that kind of stuff. Anyway, this is the team. This is the team. This, I'm not gonna, it's difficult for me to say anything without giving away the complete plot of what I, of how I'm doing. Because you have to realise that these guys have got base stats of like, 5 to 15 half the time. I mean, maybe the biggest thing that I've got is Bonsley. He has a, like a stat of 40 maybe in his attack. But either way, weakest party. Boom. Need that. That was a clever thing that I threw on at the end. Didn't think it made much difference, but it really does. Counter. Boom. Yes, he's got sturdy. He can hold in there. I've also had to give my Rolts uh, focus sash. This lit all of this, this whole tactic, it's on the edge of a knife. Like, it has to go almost perfect every time for it to work. So Trick Room needs to get up, obviously, because he's awful. Bonzi needs to be hit. Hit with something, um, you know, physical is the best thing, because I can use counter. Uh, Rolts, usually, I, I've actually got Destiny Bond on him, so the plan is to take out two Pokemon with counter or flail, depending on what happens, depending on who I'm fighting. And then from then on, I can do my thing, because Trick Room is already set up. Buff is out, and I'm so happy I got to use Buff. To be honest, um, Buff and more than anything, Bond's League have turned into my favourites. Um, there we go, the bullet punch, I saw that one coming to be fair. Uh, but nicely done Bond's League, I mean come on, like I totally talked over it, but he just killed him. Oh god, what's that Pokemon called? Volcarona? Volcarona? Sounds like a beer to me, but whatever. Um, and as you saw, I, god I'm talking over everything. Um, Perish Song is the only way of doing it. Bonzi is my killer. Um, apart from that, Rolts has got Destiny Bond, and then we sit in and we dig in tight with Perish Song. Uh, Mime Junior's here, um, not for multiple reasons. Firstly, he's soundproof, which is awesome. Perish Song does not affect him; it's the only way of winning. And secondly, he's tough. He's a tough cookie. He's got uh, he's got Fake Out, which was very useful just then when I had to avoid that. Um, the steel attack, which would have been super threat to get my fairies, and um, yeah, apart from that, he's just really tough. Like for a baby, he's tough. I've given him Everlight as well. Uh, also worth mentioning is Iggly Buff has Friend Guard, which is 25% discount. <laughs> so I'm slashing prices everywhere. No, 25% discount to um, the, the the attacks on your friend. It just helps his friend out. All right. Um, so here we go, we just got to hold in for one more turn. Uh, protecting up, protecting up. Strangely enough, Iggy Buff got protected, the one that I didn't need. I needed Mr. Mime to hold in there. I mean, Mime Jr. Look how tough he is. Bullet punch is effective, he don't care. I mean, fair enough, there's a reflect up there, but that's because I'm clever. That's because I'm clever when I put that up there, and I got a friend guard. And oh, everyone's dying now. Oh, everyone's dying. Goodbye. And then Caesar's down, oh no, he's down as well, I'm sorry, oh, it's goodbye. And then there's collateral damage, but Igni Buff doesn't mind. He's still dying with a smile, oh, kind of a smile. But anyway, my junior is just dancing away. Awesome. And that's how you win with a baby team. Done, sorted, what more do I need? Pfft. 
but there is more. Don't go anywhere, because oh my god, before I got that win, there was this. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we're back, right? We're back. This is a bonus. This was not planned. There was no plan for this, I didn't think this was possible, but, and if it was up against some noob, then fine. But it was up against someone who was kind of, you know, not incredible, but still, decent enough, you know, that I could tell the Pokemon were raised fine, and yada 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 yada, he had his head screwed on. But, uh, this is the true power of the crying tree. Oh, that sounds poetic and sad, doesn't it? But anyway, oh, I was so happy with this. Just, I, I feel, I kind of feel like just sitting here with a smug smile. If you could hear my smug smile, then that would all I'd need to throw out, just... Mm. But, no. Okay. Firstly, I have to point out, though, that I've had this Gardevoir and Gallade thing before. Long time ago, I did a video called Gardevoir and Gallade Show Us How Not To Do It. Uh, I think they're going to do it again, to be honest. Oh no! Oh no, I have close combat on my Bonsley. Oh, if only I had Sturdy, I do. But also, oh, oh, another thing, another thing, just pointing out. We've got a lot of Rolses here. There's a hell of a lot of Rolse family going on. So anyway, Winter's policy kicks in. Boom! I think it raises it to about, to be fair actually, it might be 120 attack it's now raised up to. It's nice either way. Shadow Ball, oomph. Why are you beating up your child like that? You, you all mega and you're in your wedding dress and you're being attacking charm? No, I'm gonna just beat the crap out of your husband. I do! Awesome, so Counter has the serious pain. I mean, the good thing about Counter on Bonzi is, is people, like, people so obviously want to punch it. Like, if if it's possible to punch Bonzi, people will try to punch Bonzi. Oh, we're gonna flail! Oh, look, we never got to use flail that much in the previous one. But down he goes, down he goes. Uh, Rolts throws out the Destiny Bond. Thank God for Trick Room, because this can come up. And oh, oh no, a Shadow Ball. Oh, no, don't hit your baby. Please don't. Oh, you'll kill it, and then my master plan will be... No, it's not. <sighs> oh, God, I love Destiny Bond so much. Oh, I'm such a horrible person, but I love it so much. <laughs> out come the Eve but right now I'm thinking, maybe I'll even need Eagly buff. Can you do it, Bonsley? Can you take out three Pokemon? That's technically a sweep. Game, set a match to my crying little tree. Thank you, people. That has been Tapon Million with your Pokemon X on my final video. <sighs> but now I'm taking a little bit here because I genuinely, genuinely want to thank everyone. Because this has been, like, I've gone from, I don't know, 10 subscribers to 400. And, like, I, I, I really wouldn't have any reason to get out of bed, apart from obviously the lovely people around me, but, you know, work-wise, I wouldn't have a reason to, to be happy in my horrible, horrible mundane job if I didn't have this to come back to. And everyone who's helped me with even trading Pokemon, even putting a like on my video, even viewing my video, hell, if you're a subscriber, then you're like my best friend. Like, hit me up sometime, we'll get a beer. I can't drink beer, I'm allergic, there you go, as a fact. But I'll have a whiskey. Either way, um, thank you, like, so much. Because you have no idea just how much it means to me. And I can't wait to do more videos in the future. Um... It's going to be a little bit of a pause, because I, li I like to take my time with the story, I like to play the whole thing through, and I like to raise my teams up, and I've got to collect all the gear again, and really I don't have that much time. But I'll try as much as I can, I'll release some other videos in the meantime, but more than anything, it's been an absolute pleasure. Tap on me and over and out, thank you.